Welcome back everybody to some more Rogue Genesis here. Uh, link for this game is in the description down below if you are interested. I had a good time with the first one, so we're going to continue on this time. Um, I wouldn't mind seeing what challenges here. So we could do single armed here. So let's try... Uh, let's try this, Shopkeeper's Vacation. On Rock Mode. Let's go. Yeah, so no coins. And we'll start with the middle. Uh, let's go Magic Wand. We didn't have that in the last time. More movement see less dash cooldown. Oh, can I just have some enemies to kill, please? Uh, let's go Magic Wand. So luckily with the Magic Wand you can see no more delay achievement unlocked. Wow, okay. Uh, let's go Bow, we didn't pick that up. Again, it fires at the nearest enemy like the uh, Magic Wand does. I think it's pretty quick as well. Uh, let's go Magic Wand here. Need to get a, a really good weapon going. That's what helped us in the last one. Uh, let's go Bow. What have we got? Oh, there goes our blessing anyway. Let's just try and pick up this farm. Right, come on. We've got this soon. So it starts off pretty slow. Uh, base damage, base defense is probably going to be good here. Alright, we're nearly done. So the, I crapped on the bow in the last one. It's actually doing some work in this one, which is good. And there we go. we get that we did lovely all right uh interestingly again probably as part of the challenge no card in the um end of stage rewards uh critical damage sure what's the blessing here yeah still the same blessing Oh, took needless damage there. It's just a magnet. There's some chicken. Uh, void blood pressure. Five percent. Let's go Void here, just to pick up Radius. Even just for the end of the level, it's really good to have that Radius. Oh yeah, 40 to go. So again, not too slow to get through this mission. Uh, let's go magic wand. Okay, next let's go here. Uh, 
damage multiplier, defense piercing, attack speed's down slightly, but damage is up. So we'll do that, I think. Grab this blessing. I could do with some more damage, though. Uh, defense piercing or iron skin. I think we go iron skin here. So, a bit of damage negation, always decent. Uh, cleaver we haven't seen, so let's do that. Okay. So I can use my... I oh know, just where I go. But that's good. Let's get that coin. Not that we need the coin. Uh, right. Push up then. We need to break nine crates. I think we go attack speed here. Head bash. Experience multiplier goes down. But that's a significant base damage increase. So we'll do that. So we're just going to look for chests here. Uh, additional projectile. Sure. Where's these chests? Oh, crates. There's one. Uh, let's go another dash. Uh, attack speed. Any other crates anywhere? Ah, come on. Hopefully we get it from that. No. It's a shame. Uh, let's go over here. Uh, let's go magic one more projectiles. Orbital. So the bats tend to be really easy to take down. Uh, base damage or attack speed? Uh, attack speed. Let's just get that attack speed going here. More crates to break. This time, ten of them. That's four. I don't think I should mix them up is the achievement. Double-edged sword. Damage. Base defense goes down. It's not a massive it's got projectile size here. Uh, we haven't got a kunai. Before, so we'll do that. I don't think we're going to get the optional here. No. Let's keep going. Armour. Spanish all defense related cards with moon tag on them. Base health, base defense. I oh, know, let's just go let's max out attack speed here. Let's get some more cleaver. Slay the champion. He's going down pretty quickly. Uh, spike shield. Let's go. 
bow here. Tower? Uh, no, let's go bow. Just get the damage. Uh, projectile size. We go critical damage here. But let's go projectile size, I think, for the God's Wrath. Just coins for that. Lovely. Uh, let's go over here. Get a artifact. Glass sword. Doubles your damage. Sure, why not? Uh, 5% damage, but max health is next to nothing. Let's do aiming here. Uh, let's go cleaver. Right, so we've got to slay the champion. Uh, weak point. More critical damage. Uh, let's go ice spirit here. Slows them. Uh, we can go cleaver. Uh, two piercing or more damage on this. Let's go magic wand here. Because it's hitting loads at the moment. Um, defense multiplier and damage mitigation. Sure. Go bow. Got another achievement there. I didn't quite see it. Um, let's go over here. Champion slain. Okay. Don't know what this is. That's oh, a magnet ball. So we'll leave that for the time being. Uh, let's go Kunai. And we want that magnet for when we finish. Again, it's just a nice change to the map to sort of come out at this size. It's just a really good take on the genre. Let's go four projectiles off the bow. Got 30 seconds to survive. Looking good here. Um go impenetrable here. Don't really want that blood pressure with the double damage glass cannon that I've got. So. Right, experience don't know why we get gold coins because unless that transpires it goes into something afterwards. Holy Cross. 25% damage, 25% movement speed, 25% health, 25% pickup range. Sure. Uh, card selection, Kunai. Yeah. Let's go up here again. Why not? Uh, max health multiplier. But we get projectile speed and movement speed down. I can deal with that. Defense multiplier. Base defense, sure. All in defense. 
So we've got to slay the champion, but I don't think that's going to be too much of an issue here. Um, go Cleaver. Focus. What's in here? Just health. Look that pick up. There's the champion gone, by the way. Protection is also important. Gold for a rainy day. Uh, let's go spike shield. Yeah, we're absolutely obliterating people at the moment. But again, this is the lowest of the lowest tiers. Don't forget. Uh, curse book. Base defense goes down. More experience. Eh. Just take more experience. Uh, let's go void, though, for the pickup range. Uh, bow maxed. Coins. Saints Shinbone, fully heal and level up. Lovely. Uh, let's go. Additional projectile here. And we have on dash throwing knife. 7.5% more damage. Let's go for this. On dash thrower a knife. really seen the knife there's the champion who is dead Be interested to see how far we could survive in the survival mode now uh let's go kunai nine projectiles literally is just incredible just melt him now some of the reviews i was reading on the game on steam say it does get more challenging some of the challenges are very challenging which is good so it's not always going to be like this uh let's go spike shield here and don't forget, I have got double damage on. I'm a proper glass cannon at the moment. Uh, let's go kunai up. Samurais are cooler. We've got a samurai sword unlocked by the looks of things. Pork aftertaste. Go kunai again. Interesting to see what the damage we do is. Cool. More gold coins. Let's go for this. Uh, yeah. Go for this. I need the chest. It's five a minute and a... Uh, cleaver. Look at the damage we're doing. Nothing can even touch us. Uh, let's go, cleaver. Maxed. We're level forty-eight at the moment. And on level up, we get a full heal. Uh, I think we could go head bash. Bow aiming, achievement unlocked. Sure. Sacrificing a bit of damage for speed. Wow, look at all of these enemies, though. Uh, 
trade off attack speed up there yeah, we'll go throwing life not really dashing at the moment though Crazy. Carve dice gives a free reroll. Uh, let's go in the middle just for the giggles. Uh, void pickup. Sure, let's get that maxed. So I've got to just survive here. So we're going to kill it as much as we can and then we'll just grab the um, magnet as we finish I think we're going to do the 2000 pretty easily here uh, let's get an additional projectile why not just explosions everywhere I picked up the magnet accidentally. Idiot. If we can get another one. Saying that, it's not like we can't just pick up all of this stuff because it's just melting. It's amazing how low it starts and the level ups are taking a long time now. Look at it, we're just melting everything. It's so good. Like you've just seen boss's health just disintegrate. Yeah, there's the throwing knife, it's pretty good. experience four and a half thousand enemies killed on that one and then we got the boss dash momentum projectile size and knockback please we've got to charge the altars again so maybe that's the boss we have for this zone As soon as one of the like magic ones pick on an enemy, it just melts. Right, where was that magnet? There it is. Yeah, just watching bosses melt is pretty fun, actually. Da -da -da -da. Uh, let's go damage mitigation and movement speed or damage oh, let's go to even more damage let's just get that damage up altar's nearly charged boss is there Some damage, but done. 15 minutes. So the magic wand killed 4,000. Bo did some serious work. As well as the kunai. Ow. That's the shopkeeper's vacation. Done. Uh, so let's. Achievement wise, we got reached 2.5 or less dash cooldown. So we get frenzy. When you're when you dash, increase your attack speed by 5% for two seconds. That's good. 
Moose cooldown between dashes plus two dash charges. Quick projectile speed, movement speed, but the size is down. Uh, dash cooldown is good. Division. Each soul card increases your damage by 2%. So I'd have 46% extra damage for that. Pike stabs in quick succession in the aim direction. Banish clumsy. Okay. Gather the power of the wind. Summon blades made of wind on each side of rock. Food also attracts all soul gems. That's pretty good. Thunderstaff. Spawns a thunderball that orbits around Rog. Nice. Do you like them? Uh, pick up 100 food. Food increases damage by 1%, up to 300%, diminishing returns after 50 foods. That'd be good. Flashes at nearby enemies. Decent. 100% chance for soul gems to be attracted. Increases experience gain by 100%, reduced gold gain. Could be good. Shield you from all harm for 4 seconds after taking damage. Good. Uh, gold multiplier upgrade. Got the magic wand. Light hand. Attack speed. Yep. And we've got the bow. Excellent. Right. Let's head to the soul shop here. And... Yeah, so we've now got gold multiplier, which could be good. So that brings that down. Okay. Uh, let's go damage here. Let's just get damage up. Now, if we go into here, does that do anything with damage? No. Okay. Get a reroll. Um, thinking max health. Let's get, might as well get a gold multiplier. Pick up distance. Another dash charge. Do I want to banish? I'd rather pick up distance to be perfectly honest. Okay, so we've got 12 left. Anything in here for 12? Probably not. Excellent. Um, yeah, so there we go. There's the first challenge done. Um, yeah, shopkeeper's vacation is done. Single armed one weapon, no soul shop bonus. Wow. Yeah, so we might do these before we head into E. I might try an E rank. What do we do? F. Yeah, probably do. I mind doing these challenges, to be honest. But yeah, we're going to call this one an episode. So uh, yeah, I'll take a think about whether we want to try an E. Um, probably will. Let's see how tough that is. And then we'll come back and do the challenges here. So please like, comment, subscribe. All the good stuff. All the check me out. Full playlist on the channel uh, is going to be on screen very, very shortly. And uh, yeah, I will see you all in the next one.